yeah how to count your safe days how to count your safe days how to count your calendar uh when you are in your periods yeah let us take uh, a person for example a woman who is going to uh, menstruate for three days because a normal lady is supposed to menstruate for three to four days not less than that and not more than that uh despite other deformities which occur so for a person who is ovulating three days from first to third day this this is menstruation they are menstruating how do they calculate we calculate we start to counting your safe days starting from the first day you began your menstruation so this one becomes our day one then we count from here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen mm -hmm. now when you reach fourteen here here this is uh the day we are expecting our lady to ovulate so ovulation is expected here so this is where we expect our ovulation to take place on the 14th day so when you reach 14th day we count two days and two days so these are dangerous days two days before the 14th day of menstruation and two days after the 14th day of menstruation are dangerous days so and these other days from here starting from here up to the 11th day they are safe days and starting from the 17th day up to the 28th day which is the termination in there they are safe days they are safe days you can have sex in those days and you don't get it pregnant so we are expecting already to ovulate on the 14th day then we count two days back that is 12 and 13 those are unsafe and two days after that is 15th and 16th they are also unsafe when you press sex when you have sex in those days you are likely to have a, uh, a baby because the sperm is spent in your body at least four to three days so when you have sex let's say here the sperm is going to be there for these few days, it will reach for